Hi folks. In this video I intend, I intend to share with you uh, the definition of a limit and also basically an introduction of a limit and then how to read them. So simply speaking the limit of a function is the intended value of the function at a given point. So if the function is continuous then the limit is just the function value but sometimes we have a function that's not continuous like this one that we see on the right. This one's definitely not continuous but it still has a limit. Okay, So the graph is actually defined as y equals x squared minus 1 over x minus 1. And the limit of y as x approaches 1 is 2. So the limit of y as x values, as x values approach 1, as x values approach 1, let's determine what happens. Well, as x values approach 1, the cursor on our calculator would be going along this uh, curve, this y equals x squared minus 1 over x minus 1, and it would get closer and closer to the function value 2. Um, and from the right side, the limit, the, as the x values go this direction, this point would be going towards this open hole that we have and it would be so it tends toward the same exact number too so we read this we read this or we write it symbolically as the limit of y as x approaches 1 is equal to 2 all right so uh, you might want to practice re writing that one out the limit of y as x approaches 1 is 2. The limit of y as x approaches 1 is equal to 2. All right, so now let's translate the mathematical notation into a complete sentence in words. Well, I know that I'm going to read limit first. So this is be the limit. What is it the limit of? The limit of u. Okay, so so far what I've read is the limit of u and then I'm going to go down to the this bottom part here. I'm going to write the word as u approach anything and then I said D and E for does not exist uh, it's mathematically wrong but it gives us an idea of how to uh, of how to read this um, now what is the limit of you as you approach anything it's actually mathematically speaking this thing should say the limit of you as you approach anything is actually you and that's also a pretty nice lesson to learn but anyway let's uh, let's continue with this next part let's try to read this one together actually try it on your own pause the video try to say it try to write it out trusting that that's done we're gonna say the limit of the function f of x as x approaches as x gets closer and closer to 7, function will be approaching the limit of fx. As x approaches 7 is equal to 5. All right? So we're just saying that the function value is getting closer and closer to 5. So if I were to draw something like that, maybe, maybe I would have 7 tick marks. So there's my x equals 7 mark. And a sketch might look like this. And there's my 5. Okay, so it's just saying that on the left side of 7, 
it's approaching 5 and on the right side of 7. Okay. All right. So today I've introduced you guys to limits. I hope you enjoyed that video. It's quick and sweet, right? See you later.